Hello dear traders, I'm Annika Sartkina. Welcome to Insta TV. Investors are selling off the US dollar in the final session this trading week. The greenback lost ground against the Japanese yen. The dollar's weakness came as the Federal Reserve stood pat on interest rates. Technical analysts hope that the dollar-yen pair will resume an upward bias. To follow a steady upward bias, the dollar-yen pair has to correct to 101.25. Otherwise, the pair could tumble below the psychological level of 100. A sharp reinforcement of the yen is an adverse scenario for Japan's monetary authorities that will obviously trigger an instant response. The Bank of Japan will resort to forex intervention. The yen retreated slightly against the US dollar on Friday on caution over such measures from the regulator regarding the currency's latest strength. Traders have changed sentiment on the pound-dollar pair in light of a speech of Bank of England's policymaker Christine Forbes. Pound bulls were inspired by the speech of the external member of the Monetary Policy Committee. The initial effect on the UK economy of the referendum has been less stormy than many expected, she said in a lecture at Imperial College London yesterday. Looking forward, I'm not convinced that additional monetary easing will be necessary to support the economy, she noted. The pound sterling rose to 1.31 against the US dollar. Following the speech of Mark Carney, traders rushed to close buy positions, booking profits. As a result, the pound-dollar pair dropped 100 pips. Bank of England Governor Mark Carney stayed away from British monetary policy and assessment of the economy in a speech he gave in Berlin at the same time as Forbes. Follow further developments on financial markets on InstaForex TV channel. Bye.